Good morning. So this morning, Saturday morning, July 3rd, it's about 6 o'clock in the morning. I'm going to go do a walk around the Western Hills Shopping Center. And we'll catch the sunrise. Got to get the coffee going. not sleep to save my life last night so I figure well I'll get up since we got up early here might as well try and get some of the sunrise walk around test out the new camera here to show some of the beautiful scenery here got the sun about to come up okay so we've made it to Western Hills Plaza here as you can see I don't want to blind you guys but we got the sun just coming up over, right over top of Target over there. They did just do a remodel here of the GameStop. Uh, they kind of split this store between GameStop and iMart. Got a Panda Express. What I'm going to do is I'm going to drive over to the other part here. I just wanted to show you the GameStop they got. It's, that's a store me and Jess frequent. <laughs> but we're going to go over there. And I'm going to show you some of the new stores they got. And we're just going to walk around, basically uh, walking around testing out the new camera. I need to remember not to point myself into the sun. Because when you do that, obviously a camera's going to wash out. You're not going to be able to see your face or anything like that. I'm trying to get a good view in the morning. See how the camera's working. We got a lot of events coming up, so I, I need to kind of do a crash course on this thing. Figure it out. Come walk with me. We're going to tour the plaza a little bit, get a good feel of how this camera works. Okay, now here we're in a little bit of darker lighting. I'm not going to walk all the way back there, but we got the new chicken salad chick, chicken salad place. Sleep outfitters. I don't know how many sleeping stores we have over here now. We got the Ulta Beauty. And right here we got the new Old Navy not a huge fan of Old Navy, but I know a lot of people like it. And right here at the corner, we got Spectrum, which I don't know why they put that in here. There was a Spectrum down the street. It was a small store. I don't really see why they needed it to be any bigger. But this is pretty much uh, the main drag of a lot of things we go to, a lot of shops. They're redoing the Dunkin' Donuts down here. As you can see, I got my Starbucks. I got this from Kroger's across the street over there. Pretty awesome. I gotta say, it is an absolute gorgeous morning. Okay, so flip the camera here for a second. So there's this place that pops up over right over here every now and then. And they sell steaks. A pop-up tent that sells steaks. Try to zoom in here. And you can see right here. I don't know. I've I don't know anybody who's tried that. I know that was out here last year during the pandemic. I don't know. I'm a little weary about buying a steak in a tent. So I've been checking the audio on this thing. The audio sounds pretty good. I love the wide angle camera. I am gonna be using the wide angle camera as we go throughout this video here to kind of get a good idea of how it is. Also checking out the image stabilization because I'm not using the gimbal right now. I want to see how well it does just by itself. Uh, gimbal's great, but you know, what I don't like about the gimbal is you can't really make a sudden movement. Like it moves real slow, you know, and it, it, when, when, it when you're trying to pan something, you know, sometimes I like to get real close fast shots let's talk about this place for a second here we got Dollar Tree me and Jess love this place I mean it is great go in there you feel rich here's something interesting check out this uh... so they're doing some work here I just left this sitting here. <laughs> Hope they took the keys. Here we got a Michaels right here. I know Jess loves that place. Now we're bigger fans of Hobby Lobby. As you guys know, we go to Hobby Lobby quite often. 
so far I've been very impressed with this phone. I'm glad I got this. Uh, if you guys keep hearing airplanes, this is the hour. It's about 7.30 in the morning. Um, and this is the time when all the planes are heading into the airport. So you're probably going to hear a lot of planes in the background. Hopefully you don't. Hopefully the noise canceling on my audio here is working pretty good. Here we got, uh... Wow, I forget the name of this store. Oh, there go a bunch of birds. This is City Gear. Never really go in there. I buy all my sports stuff at Walmart. <laughs> Or Target, which we'll get to here eventually. And the Target that we're coming up on is the Target that we always go to to try and find our Disney Parks merchandise, which we never find in there. But you can find stuff every now and then. But especially with the Disney stores closing, a lot of people have been coming to Target to buy it all up because I guess they've partnered with Disney. Disney's starting to sell a lot of uh, Disney Parks or. Er, Target is starting to sell a lot of Disney Parks merchandise. What planes are really sailing in today? As you can see over here, there's Target right here. We got a TJ Maxx, which I feel is kind of a hidden gem. I uh, don't know a lot of people that go to TJ Maxx, but this particular store has a lot of cool stuff. A lot of random stuff, not just clothes. But they've got toys and, and all kinds of all kinds of little trinkets. <clears throat> so I'm trying not to edit too much out of this either. I'm trying to keep it going, seeing how well the camera does when I flip it around and stuff. This is pretty much just an earthquake test of the camera, but I wanted to put something out here for you guys today because I've been doing the transition of switching everything to this phone and some of our other equipment that we're going to be using. And I really wanted to get ahead of the game because, we, like I said before, we have a lot of events coming up. One of the main things that, you know, you're concerned with is how well your audio is going to be. Now, I have external microphones. Um, I haven't tried hooking those up yet. I have to get the right connections because my uh, charger connector on this phone doesn't work with my old phone. Like I said in the last video, my old phone, it was pretty much prehistoric. Yeah, it's pretty nice. This place will be packed here later on. I wanted to get up here early, get a good start to the day, hang out with you guys, have a cup of coffee. You guys know we love taking you with us and uh, have a cup of coffee, enjoy the day. It is beautiful out here this morning. This is another reason I wanted to come out here early. It's like 60 degrees, no humidity. Now they said it's supposed to go up to 82 today. And uh, hopefully, knock on wood, uh, we're supposed to be doing the balloon, the hot air balloon glow tonight at Coney Island on the east side of Cincinnati. It's a really cool event. Uh, that's kind of another reason why I'm trying to hurry up and put this out here because I want to see how this does so I know what I'm able to do for the show tonight. Also wanted to point out some of the cool stores we have over here. Me and Jess frequent here at the Western Hills Plaza Shopping Center, whatever you want to call it. Uh, there's some nice stores in here. They got staples down there, like I showed you. They got the GameStop. Um, yeah, it's a nice place where you can do a little bit of shopping, not too far away. I feel like they're starting to put in some more stores around here. They're starting to, to build. We need some restaurants. We need more restaurants on this side of town. Uh, there was a time where it seemed like everything was closing down, even before the pandemic. I almost feel like now after the pandemic, people are starting to buy up more properties and, and things are getting built. We got a Sonic coming in. I can't wait for that. I love Sonic, but the closest one to us is like 20 miles away. So not really worth the drive for a Sonic Blizzard. But uh, yeah, just wanted to do this video with you guys. It's a really awesome place here. I really love the new phone here. I love the camera. Uh, when I get done editing here, I'll be putting this video out right away. So yeah, if you're here on the west side of Cincinnati, come get you a steak from a circus tent. <laughs> I don't know. I need to talk to somebody that's actually had one from there 
and let me know that they're actually good before I try it. Ah, that's good. What's your favorite coffee? Let me know down in the comments. I, I've been trying new coffees lately. Uh, we have the Keurig at our home and I've just been, I don't know, I before I would just try ones that were cheap, more bang for your buck, and then I started realizing that if I spend the extra dollar, I can get really good coffee. I feel like for me, it's a toss up between Dunkin' Donuts and Starbucks. Uh, Starbucks, if I'm exhausted and I need a really big pick me up, uh, Dunkin' Donuts or Donut Shop, the original Donut Shop coffee. I like that too. Actually, uh, that's what I usually drink in the mornings. But as I told you in the beginning of the video, man, I, I've had like four hours of sleep. I just could not sleep last night. I think it's the weather, the temperature really dropped. And normally you would think that would be good, but your body gets used to all the humidity and heat and all that, and now it drops, I don't know. So probably end up taking a nap before we do the hot air balloon thing tonight. So, and that video will be out tomorrow on the 4th of July. And uh, speaking of which, you guys have a great 4th of July weekend. I really appreciate you guys joining me on my vlogging journey with the new camera. Hopefully it does well. I'm sure it will. Uh, it's, it's been really awesome. So with all that being said, I'm out. And always remember, the adventure is out there.